is Paul Morgan. I'm the Departmental Manager for Sport Management. When you have a degree title like BA Honours Sport Management and Rugby Studies, Football, Golf and Coaching Studies, naturally you would think that you may be out in the field actually playing. What we try to do is focus much more on the academic aspects of the business side in particular. The course is academically based but um, you get to play sports for a student's union. The type of student that might be interested is someone who's got a passion for sport but is also keen to study the business behind it. So it might be the marketing, the management aspects, but it's all specifically related to sport. Most of the modules are very theory based. Uh, sports coaching is one of the most practical based but obviously it's looking at developing you as a sports development officer or a sports community coach not so much um, you know the next David Beckham if you like. We did everything from uh, coaching to marketing, a little bit of psychology, a little bit of science in there. Second year was good so you're picking your modules and where you want to focus on, do you want to focus management or coaching or science. And the third year has been I think the biggest step up of all, uh, a lot of work and there's a bit more sort of individual study to go with it. Well when I came to the open day I was really impressed with the knowledge of the lecturers. I got talking to um, one of the main lecturers called Francisco and he was telling me about the industry links they have with like Wickham Wanderers, uh, London Wasps and I just thought whilst I was at uni I really wanted to get some work experience as well and it seemed like they were promising a lot of experience and that's definitely what has been delivered. I spoke to a couple of lecturers here and they, um, they really sold it to me quite well. Um, they related a lot of the modules to the industry which was very attractive. We like to promote to the students the idea of combining the academic learning with the application because I'm a great believer that that's one thing that's going to make them more employable. All the lecturers that I have seem to have very good uh, knowledge of the industry that they've come from and they're very happy to share their experience with us. I've only been here for a couple of years so I've worked in industry so I know what employees are looking for and so we're trying to say to students you need to, to really start from and engage with as soon as you get here and put yourself out and the ones that are proactive do really well. They, they sort of really concentrate on the um, sort of the practical, the vocational side that it's all about sort of your, your industry knowledge and the industry contacts that you're going to gain while you're at university. We've got um, strong partnerships with WASPs, uh, London WASPs, Wick and Wanderers and we're finding now that those people that show willing, hard working and want to go off and sort of get jobs in the industry, we're finding that they have success as long as they've sort of applied themselves and got the relevant qualifications. Wick and Wanderers come down, London WASPs come down um, on quite a regular basis to talk to the students. The thing that probably makes us distinctive is uh, the way we use some of those partnerships. Some of the key guest speakers, Adrian Morehouse was in the other day talking to the sports management students um, about his experiences and about the principles of leadership and how he can relate from his own business experience to the academic theory that's been presented. Those links are very clear. It's not a separate activity in terms of gaining work experience that's something separate from their studies, it's something that's actually integral to their studies. I always compare it to other studies that I've done like back home. You do speak to your tutors but here it's more of a relationship that you build. I've enhanced my CV so much just in these three years more than I have like my whole like school life so if you're willing to put in the effort then the course will benefit you greatly. Yeah. But very open, very approachable and um, they will sort of uh, listen and try and do the best for you. I've made some absolutely brilliant friends. Um, I cannot stress that enough, I don't think. Um, I think friends that will stay with me for a very long time. By the time you finish your degree, you, you go away with a massive bag full of goodies that you can sell. And one of those is your honours degree, but other goodies are all these opportunities and experience that you have had in the, in, in, in the industry. Um, you get sort of expert sort of uh, coach education from um, sort of Tim Holmes who's the rugby development officer for the RFU in Buckinghamshire. Um, Dave Lorham is the um, head of uh, community rugby at London Wasps and um, there's a couple of other guest coaches that we've had in as well that really sort of uh, sort of educate us as a coach and try and develop that coaching craft that we're going to need you know, if we choose to use it. Um, so that you know, in terms of the sort of quality of contacts we've got, they're sort of really quite high. We put them through a 12 week course of coach education um, which gives them a grounding to deliver tag rugby within the school environment. 
You put them on the RFU Tag Rugby course and the IRB Rugby Ready course. The RFU Tag Rugby course is a course designed by the Rugby Football Union um, and it's a generic three hour course that's delivered all over the country and it's recognised within the sports industry. Uh, the IRB Rugby Ready course is the International Rugby Board Award um, which is recognised globally. So for the students who want to go on and travel and coach then it is a recognised qualification. I think when I first came I was quite keen on the sort of management side, the sports management side and um, I think through the sort of, sort of management we have with Tim and Dave and um, the experiences I've got I've sort of really sort of started to develop as a coach a bit more. We put all the students to the CRB check, which is the Criminal Records Bureau check, which enables them to go out and deliver within the schools. Also as well as opportunities to work closely with London Wasps to find out how a professional club is run. And we've had guest speakers as well, such as the marketing manager and the ground safety from London Wasps come down and explain their role within the partnership. In my first year, I um, sort of got the opportunity to go to um, Twickenham during the Six Nations. I was sort of shadowing and getting a little bit of work experience um, for the England Italy game. Got to uh, meet some of the squad players and Martin Johnson. I was uh, in the changing rooms before the game, um, and it was just incredible got to be on the pitch and been on the pitch a few times since it's sort of a lifelong ambition that you sort of always think I really want to get on the pitch but you never think it's going to happen. With London Wasps we've got three full-time members of staff working for them who have graduated from the university. We've also got community rugby coaches for Worcester Warriors, London Irish, Harlequins for their rugby league and for their rugby union side um, and also Saracens as well. So a lot of the students have gone on to work for professional clubs following the course here. In terms of the experiences that you get, the contacts and rugby is such a small world that you really do have to you know, know the right people in the right places and yeah, definitely the right choice. Bucks is the only university at the moment delivering a course like this that's purely looking at the rugby studies element of it and also linked to the RFU and linked to London Wasps as well. It gives the course a lot of kudos. Being involved with rugby is, uh, is a hobby for me, but also a hobby for a lot of the students as well. Be able to turn your hobby into a profession is a big plus. And like I said previously, it's a unique course that they run here, linked to the Rugby Football Union and to, to London Wasps. And the opportunities they gain while being on the course aren't opportunities you can get in, in, in everyday life. 